New at 430, animal shelters across Hampton Roads, they are filling up fast. Staff members at the Virginia Beach Animal Care and Adoption Center tell 13 News Now more owners are dropping off their pets and they can't keep up. Animal control officials think the pandemic is partly to blame for this new trend. Allison Basil is live at the shelter now. Hey, Allison. Hey, yeah, officials say they're taking in a lot more dogs and cats, but also smaller animals like more than 100 bunnies. Take a look in this cage right here. Virginia Beach Animal Control picked up the little guys yesterday, and you can see them all in the cage. There's another cage on the other side that you can't see. The shelter is overwhelmed right now, and adoption officials are asking for the community's help. They're socialized. Um, so they're used to being handled. They're used to people. The Virginia Beach Animal Care and Adoption Center is up to its ears in rabbits. We are looking to uh, to find new homes for about 150. Animal Control Supervisor Megan Conti says an owner surrendered them to officers. Reproduce very quickly. That term of breed like rabbits. It is a true, true term. <laughs> Inside the shelter, space is getting limited. We're nervous. <laughs> We're getting a little cramped. Lately, staff members say they are taking in more dogs and cats than they are adopting out. The last couple of weeks have been a little stressful. We have been seeing a lot of owner surrendered pets. Shelter operations supervisor Jessica Wilde says the shelter hit record lows in 2020. People had a lot of extra time, so they came and they adopted new family members. Conti says they usually take in more pets during the summer, but not this many. The pandemic has a lot to do with that because people are out of work, less income, less ability to care for animals. So we're seeing a larger number of owners surrender their animals because they can't care for it or animals that the officers are having to investigate. Close to 50 dogs are up for adoption. Wildy says that's almost double the shelter's normal volume. Staff hopes to find all the animals forever homes. Our main goal is good placements, lifelong placements and helping the community. And officials at the shelter tell me there are multiple programs to help owners with expenses for their pets. And coming up on 13 News Now at 530, I'll share what's available. But guys, if you need a p bunny, they're here at the <laughs> animal shelter. Back to you. All right, Allison, thank you. That's good to know. We also talked to uh, officials at the Norfolk SPCA. They tell us they're also struggling with more pets coming in. They encourage everyone in the community, if they're able to, to save a life by adopting.